Hi, I'm Wheeler Winston Dixon, James Ryan Professor of Film Studies at the University of Nebraska-Lincoln, and this is Frame by Frame. And we're here to talk about the digitization of cinema. From its inception in roughly the late 1890s, um, cinema was more or less entirely done on film. And it's only really with the advent of computers um, around the turn of the century, 2000, that film became more digitally based. But what is happening is that film is disappearing. Uh, Kodak produced its last reels of 16 millimeter film a couple of years ago. 35 millimeter film, which is the standard theatrical gauge, is endangered. Uh, you can see from the studio's point of view this makes perfect sense cost consciously because digital copies of a film can either be beamed down by a satellite or sent on digibeta cassettes or on DVDs with elaborate encryption systems so that they can't be uh, pirated so easily. And 35mm prints, which have been the standard for a century in films, although they have beautiful pictorial quality, are extremely heavy. And they're also easily pirated, and so you'd be saving billions of dollars in prints um, and in the cost of shipping and insurance and things like that if the thing becomes more, if the process of making films becomes more and more digital. There is a problem, though, with this, and that is that films that are now made that are called born digital films cost more to preserve than films that are shot on film. It's estimated that to preserve a film on film costs only about $500 a year because you make a fine grain negative, put it in the vault, and there it is. But born digital films with all of their outtakes cost about $20,000 a year to preserve because you have to keep moving them from each succeeding platform as platforms become obsolete. Nevertheless, the digitization of films is an accomplished fact. And the head of NATO, which is the National Association of Theater Owners, John Fithian, recently said, what we have to do is tear down conventional theaters as fast as we can and put up digital theaters as fast as we can because there is no question the digitization is the next step in the history of cinema. So film is going away, but movies are not. Movies will always be with us, and now they'll be digital. I'm Wheeler Winston Dixon, and this is Frame by Frame.